I have found a new ISO build that is breaking NBA 2K22. A build that can get shifty and leave defenders lost on the court. A build that can shoot over defenders like they aren't even there. A build that is able to shoot crazy off-balance shots from limitless. A build that is actually able to fade from anywhere on the court. A build that is going to patch those left-right guards you can't stand. A build that is going to have the interior defense to stop those rim runners. A build that is going to snatch block those toxic post forwards. All with max wingspan and all of the takeover options. This is what I like to call the two-way play shot. What is good, YouTube? It is your boy, Henry, aka Double H, back at it with yet another banger. In today's video, I got another build video for you guys. Now, today's build video is actually on PlayStation. Yes, we are on PlayStation with it right now. So make sure you guys drop a like if you guys want me to make more builds. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. One million subscribers on the way. A lot of y'all be watching my build videos and you're not even subscribed. Hit that subscribe button, yo. But look, we're going to be going over a lot of things today. We're going to be showing you guys gameplay of this new ISO build, how to make the build, the best bad setup with this build. And I have no extra badges on PlayStation from level 39 because I've never hit it. So this is going to be a perfect example of the best bad setup with no extra badges towards it. And I'm also going to show the best animations, including drill moves, dunk packages, fadeaway, step back shots, all that good stuff. Now, this is what I like to call the two-way play shot build, okay? Now, it is called a three-point playmaker. Yes, a three-point playmaker at 99 overall is absolutely a demigod. If you guys remember in 2K21, I actually had a three-point playmaker and I used to ISO with it. This build is very similar to that build. Now, before I show some gameplay, how to make the build, all that good stuff, let's show this build at 99 overall. Oh, my God, lock take, max wingspan. Yo, 87 three-pointer is crazy. That is the highest three-pointer out of any of my ISO builds. 87 ball handle. Look at the defensive stats. This build is very well-rounded. It also has a 71 driving dunk with some of the most unblockable dunks in the game that I'm going to show at the end of the video. But look, y'all, I'm about to show you guys some gameplay. about to show you guys how to make this build. Make sure you guys comment down below. Goaded builds in the comment section if you guys are going to watch this video all the way through and if you guys are noting and want to join Double Nation so you could potentially be featured or shouted out into the next video. But anyways, let's go ahead and show you guys some fire gameplay I've had with this build. I've only had this build max for a little less than a week. Okay, y'all. So here is the official three-point playmaker, two-way play shot build, whatever you want to call it, gameplay. Now, I have gone on multiple streaks with this build that you're going to see later in this gameplay. I also went on the 88-game win streak in the park, but all these clips right here are going to be stage clips. Now, a lot of people have been asking for my build ever since I've been streaming with this build, so that's why I'm bringing it to you guys today. I also have a 95 win percent on PlayStation and a 93 win percent on Xbox, so I know what I'm doing with these builds. Now, this is a simple build right here. Now, when it comes to the driving... It gets the, you know, the unblockable dunks, the safe dunks. It doesn't do anything crazy. Now, here's a bunch of shooting and dribbling clips right here. Look, at, I'm playing around. That was a legend two-way right there. Step back three, green. Now, this build is very fast. It, you know, it gets a 97 speed, but it dribbles very fast. Look at that. Shoot over people, too. It can shoot contested shots as well. Its three-pointer is high enough. It can shoot. Look at, like, come on, bro. Low energy, shooting some wild shots with this build, still making them very shifty with this build it's a great shooting build basically very fast at dribbling too like i said hall of fame shooting hall of fame dribbling those are definitely its best two things they can also fade i haven't even tried circus threes yet and i can fade with this build so even if i tried circus threes Oh my god, this build could probably go crazy with the fading. It can crab. It can literally do everything you would possibly want the build to do when it comes to shooting and dribbling. There's nothing it can't do. Unlocks all the man animations very fast, very shifty, at a tall height. Can shoot over tall defenders. Can shoot blinder shots. You know what I'm saying? Quick stop. Shoot low energy. Make whites. Has Hall of Fame sniper. And y'all are going to see these clips. I mean, look at all these clips right here. These This little span right here is all one game. This guy could not guard me. As you can see, we just spin him out of his shoes right there now i got takeover and you know what i'm saying i was over dribbling a, a lot right here look at he, he jumps i get the easy mid-range right so that's we're at 18 right and i'm gonna get 200 buckets right here look at, i'm playing around with this dude he's jumping at the layup i'm stepping back green like oh my god right here he's jumping i over dribbled right he's clamping me right seven seconds you think oh yeah he you know low energy you're not making a shot right here 
you just wait, bro. Boom. Green. I'm still green and after dribbling for 24 seconds, y'all. 22 game win streak in PlayStation stage. And that's just the twos gameplay. Look at here's some ones gameplay in this stage right here. I went on a little like 15 game win streak on the 1v1 court today uh, with the build. And look at this, bro. I'm just toying with dude, these, these dudes, bro. Like the off. Look at that. Did you just see that shot? The offense on this build is absolutely crazy. And wait until I show you guys the defensive clips. Because you're like, okay, the offense is good. You know, the driving subpar. But what about the defense, right? We're going to show you the defense in a second. This is a post score right here. Look at Look at it. Power of mismatch expert, seven foot three post score. It is a real player that's not an AI shooting right over him. He's right in front of me. This dude right here, we have 19 at zero. You know what I'm saying? And we just cook it up. Simple as that. You know what I'm saying? Now let's get into some defensive clips right here. I got a couple for you guys right here. Legend post score pulled up, snatch block. Okay, yes, this build can get snatch blocks. Absolutely crazy. I know. We got another snatch block clip and another crazy clip that I'm going to show you guys in a second here. This dude over dribbled. I get the pluck steal. I get a lot of steals on this build, by the way. And boom, green. Now, I'm not even through showing any gameplay from the 88 game win streak. We had a bunch of clips from there, too. This is just stage uh, gameplay right here. Another plug steal, easy green. Look at this dude. I had lock take. I literally clamp him for all 24 seconds. Literally just some left, right play shot. 100% smother gets graded out because I also scored like 18 points on him. This dude breaks me, right? And I still get back to get the, the contest on him. And he misses the dunk on me because my defensive stats are that good on this build. And I have max wingspan. Another miss dunk i'm telling you bronze intimidator my interior defense it's good enough to make people miss dunks and then i get the easy safe dunk that i was talking about earlier now this post score misses a post uh shot right there i step back just green now what i'm about to show you guys as you can see this this level 40 mascot pulled up right on my stream this is the last clip i'm going to show you guys he was a three-star level 40 mascot pure lock literally a lockdown probably had 30 defensive badges and basically what i did in my chat if you guys follow me on twitch we did a channel point like gamble thing where the chat can gamble their points and the question was will this will the opponent score one point or more so all this dude had to do was score one point and people were voting on it 80 percent of my chat was like obviously this is good dude's gonna score one point so it was very intense now here go the gameplay right here now make sure to go follow my twitch so you can watch this stuff live my twitch is just double age so it'll be linked in the description i stream every single day at 6 p.m eastern but look it i'm cooking them right i'm cooking them up you know what i'm saying he's a pure lock bro he's literally made to play defense and he's a three-time low of 40 he plays this game you know what i'm saying so we're up 10 to 0 you know i'm taking my safe dunks like i said this bill gets safe dunks or, you know what I'm saying? I'm patient with it. Get the easy layup. We're up 14 to 0. Another dunk because he has to play high on me because earlier I was shooting threes. Look at this. 16 to 0. He gets a stop right here, right? So all he has to do is score one point, right? It's going to be intense for the chat. All he has to do is score once. Look at this. Ball stripper. He thinks he's going out of bounds, so he starts dancing. He's not going out of bounds. We're getting the ball back. I have a 97 speed. Easy dunk again. We're up 20 to 0. He gets another lucky steal. Look at, look at the defense. Smothered. Lock take. Smothered again. Lock take in the one of the worst interior defensive games of ever look at this he just go up snatch block you're not scoring on me buddy this dude had like five chances to score didn't score once he literally had turnovers missed shots i was absolutely outplaying this dude because this build is very good offensively and very good defensively as well anyways let's show you guys how to make this build all right so now that we are in the build system it is time to create the two-way play shot this is definitely one of my favorite iso builds yet the highest three-pointer on any of my iso builds yet and it's a little throwback to 2k21 as well i had a build similar to this on there that i used to iso with but anyways before we get into making the build make sure you go to your main menu settings change from imperial system to metric system so you can get an extra quarter of an inch on this build if you're going to spend the time and the money to make a new build you may as well get the build as best as possible when you make it so just go ahead and do it okay so position we're gonna go shooting guard so we can get rim protector if you guys didn't know point guards do not get rim protector so definitely don't pick the point guard pick shooting guard left hand uh, we're gonna go jersey number one for derrick rose now with the pie chart now a lot of my pie charts have red they have blue but today's pie chart is gonna be different okay we are going to go with the green yellow pie chart okay very simple pie chart very popular pie chart as well but 
this build i haven't seen too much and this build is one of my favorite builds that i've made before in prior 2ks but anyways we're gonna go with the first physical which is the speed pie chart so we can get that 98 99 speed now with this build we're gonna start with the defense we want this defense to be insane we want the best defense as possible especially since we picked the yellow red pie chart so we're gonna max interior defense max perimeter defense max lateral quickness max the steel max the block max the defense run max the offensive rebound so as you can see everything in defense is completely maxed out and if you look at the right we only have 10 defensive badges which is actually pretty good but we may as well save some attribute upgrades so let's go down on the offensive rebound until we don't have 10 boom we're down to nine and boom we're back to 10 so we save about what eight attribute upgrades right there so look at that that's gonna be the final defense we have 10 defensive and if you have any extra badges uh towards hitting level 39 which i have never done on playstation i have no extra badges on this build uh you could put that towards defense you know what i'm saying to even help it out even more but anyways with the playmaking we're gonna mass max the pass accuracy max the ball handle and we're gonna put the post control all the way until we have 22 okay so 22 playmaking is gonna be just the sweet spot 52 post control we have 22 play making 10 defense and now with the shooting okay we are going to put the major mid-range that could go to a 90 but we're gonna put it to an 86 okay three pointer is gonna be maxed free throw is gonna be maxed post fade is gonna go to a 63 which is gonna give us exactly 22 shooting badges now with the driving we only have 51 attribute upgrades now obviously the driving is probably gonna be the weakest thing with this build but it's still going to be good and i'm going to show you guys how you can make it good with the animations and all that good stuff and drive just as good as my build does in gameplay because if you guys watch me play on stream with this build you would think the driving dunk is a lot higher anyways we're gonna max the driving dunk all the way to a 65 and we're gonna put the driving lamp all the way to a 68. we are not gonna get any finishing badges except for one but if you have your extra badges um from 39 you can go ahead and put it on limitless takeoff i only had bronze limitless takeoff and i'm going crazy with this build okay anyways these are the attributes right here they're not completely finished body shape you can go with whatever you want i went with compact okay now the height now if you look up on we're, we're on we're on metric okay we're we're not on imperial so basically what we want for every drill move in the game is to be six four or shorter if you go six five you can't get d rose you can't get dribble style steve nash you can't get a lot of the good drill moves okay so we want to be six four or below so if you look up on google how tall is 64 meters it's gonna say about 1.93 how tall is 65 it's about 1.95 like 555 so if you go 1.95 you can actually get all those dribbles and still be labeled under 65 but you're damn near 65 okay so we're gonna go 1.95 meters which is almost 65 it's 64 and some change we're gonna go minimum weight okay so minimum weight max wingspan yes this is what makes this build's defense even more crazy here okay now if we look at this build you're still gonna have crazy stats at 99 it's one of the easiest pie charts to grind out to 99 green yellow this this is also the pie chart that gets the most rep as well so very good pie chart right here we have an 87 ball handle we're gonna get every drill move 87 three-pointer that is way more than good enough to shoot 71 dunk we're gonna get the best unblockable dunks we don't we won't get contacts but we'll get very good unblockable dunks and look at the defense we'll have an 80 perimeter defense an 80 lateral an 86 steel 74 yo that is very good for this pie chart anyways max wingspan here are the takeover options yes you can get sharp takeover even with max wingspan which is very good now i would not pick play i would not pick shot creating go sharp or lock i went lock because i want this player to even be more lethal on defense and when people see my build name and lock takeover it's gonna be a little catfishy as well you know so yeah we're going lock takeover i would go lock or sharp doesn't really matter we're going with lock and that is the two-way play shot i like to call it otherwise known as the three-point playmaker which i had in nba 2k21 as well this is the build right here compared to mono ginobili tyler hero and desmond bain but anyways let's get into the bad setup the animations and all that good stuff okay y'all so we are in the park in the stage whatever on my three-point playmaker build yes we are at 99 overall you guys saw the 99 overall stats in the beginning of the video here they go again i don't have a lot of the good sleeves there is a plus one three-pointer sleeve 
ball handle, driving dunk. You could add those. But yeah, here are the final stats. The defensive stats look great. We're in the 80s, high 80s. Playmaking stats look great, high 80s. Three-point stats, shooting stats look great, high 80s. And driving dunks, this stat is good enough. 71, I'm going to show you guys the animations you can get, and they're the best unblockable dunks, so you're going to be chilling. Let's go ahead and get into the badges to start. For my badge setup, I don't have any plus one badges on PlayStation from hitting level 39, because I've never hit level 39 on PlayStation yet. So this badge setup will really be helpful to just about anyone, and if you do have extra badges, I would recommend either going to put it on driving or defense it's really up to you if you want limitless takeoff on a higher level put it on finishing if you want more defensive badges put it on defense or maybe a little bit of both anyways driving badges put it on bronze limitless takeoff 100 percent there's there's no comparison just do it okay it's literally the best driving badge anyways shooting badges we get yo this is my only build that has hall of fame shooting badges so we got Hall of Fame snipers so we can make more, we can make hella whites and we can get the green window bigger. Stop and pop so we can, when we stop after dribbling, we can hit them greens. Mismatch expert is a huge W. Basically, you could shoot over taller defenders. A lot of people like to switch the center, the lock on me uh, on the twos court. So that is going to go ahead and help me. Bronze lucky number seven. Give a little boost for seven seconds of the shot clock. Silver hot zone hunter is actually good. You know, Hall of Fame and gold are better, but silver is still very good to save some badge points. Bronze green machine. So when I'm greening up, you know, so I can continue to green up. Silver chef is the perfect happy medium. So I can shoot from really deep sometimes. And then Hall of Fame blinders. So people can't get the contest on the side of me. Very good bad setup right here. If you want to change around a couple things, you know, maybe bronze volume, maybe put up dead eye a little bit. Maybe bronze catch and shoot. Uh, if you want to fade from three, maybe put up circus threes a little bit. But otherwise, I think this is the best setup to go with. Now, when it comes to the playmaking badges, we have 22 as well. And we also get Hall of Fame. So we're going to go Hall of Fame quick chain. It's going to make you dribble faster. Hall of Fame quick first step so you can go off the dribble faster. Hall of Fame handles for days so you don't lose as many as much energy when you do dribble. So then when you're ready to shoot your shot after creating space, you have the energy to be able to shoot that. Hall of Fame tight handles. Very important on this build. You can stun defenders with certain dribble moves and get very open very easily silver unpluckable you know i don't like to put a lot of points towards unpluckable because i do be getting ripped regardless but silver will work silver bullet passer is definitely the minimum you want to add so when you do pass to your open teammates they're still open when the ball gets to them silver dimer as well just to help out my teammates a little bit yeah but that's good right there you can even put unpluckable down the bronze maybe add one of these or maybe if you don't want dime or just go full bullet passer it's really up to you but this is the bad setup i got right here maybe even add bailout floor general otherwise i don't see any other badges that are worth it ankle breaker or hyperdrive and space critter are not that good this year uh hyperdrive is a new badge but i don't think it is that important especially on the twos court and then my defensive badges we have gold rim protector yes so i when i do get a block i can get hella takeover from it and i do get stash blocks with this build silver ball stripper so if people are rim running me or a post score is posting me up I could easily just strip the ball, get an easy steal, silver clamps, bronze intercepted to get in the lanes, bronze intimidator, and bronze chase down animate or chase down artist just so I can unlock those chase down animations. And that is the defensive bad setup we are going with. If you want to go with something else, maybe you can go bronze ball stripper and add bronze pickpocket or bronze pick dodger. But otherwise, this is the bad setup I'm going with. Now it's time to go ahead and look at the animations that I have on this build. Now I do have some drill moves. You can go ahead and copy them down. Uh, these are the drill moves I've been using on this build. Go ahead, copy them down. I'm not really going to go through them. Now the dunks, like I was saying earlier, 71 driving dunk is good enough. Just put on rim grazers off one. Okay, no one can block these dunks, okay? And quick drop off the one. This dunk package is literally unblockable, okay? It's going to be the first animation. Watch the first animation. Look at this one. You can't block that. It's literally unstoppable. Um, so yeah, just put those on. Put long athlete layup package and you're good to go, okay? You know what I'm saying? Uh, that one hop jumper that I do where I shoot it with one leg, that's Nikola uh, Jokic hop jumper. Dribble pull. My fate is Trey Young. My jump shot will be linked in the description. And yeah, those are the animations I'm going with. Those are the best animations I got. 
for you for this build. That's gonna do it for today's build video. Now, if you clicked on this video just for the build, make sure to click that subscribe button. I guarantee you we have plenty of videos on the channel that are very entertaining. This is just one of my tutorial videos type stuff. So make sure to check out the other videos on the channel. There should be two videos on your screen right now. Go check them out, okay? We got some banger content on the channel. Make sure to drop a like on the video if this video helped you out at all. It's been your boy, Henry, aka Double H, and I'm out, y'all. Peace.